best time to plant a tree was 20 years ago. Second best time is right now. GI season, GI8. Shout out to all my people on the ground right now. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Let's jump right on in. Happy Valentine's Day as well. So we're going to start off with the brows like I always do. And we're just going to use our spoolie to straighten the hairs out. Then we're just going to take our BH Cosmetics Brow Palette, the Studio Pro Brow Palette. We're going to take that black shade, the gel one, because they do have powder and then we have gel at the bottom of that palette. So I'm just going to take the black gel and we're just going to start off with the ends. Now I do my brows all the time, so if you guys want an in-depth, you know, tutorial, then I do have an eyebrow tutorial you can watch. I will i-card it right here. But we about to get this brow together. Look at that. Voila. We went from that to that. Now we're just going to clean up our brows since we got both brows situated. And we're going to clean it up with my L'Oreal Pro Glow Concealer. And I believe this one's in Cocoa. Yeah, that's Cocoa. I know. But it's actually pretty good. I like this concealer. I feel like it's too thin, but it's okay. gonna start cleaning up the top I use a darker concealer for this one because I want to be able to blend that concealer out I don't want that halo effect over my brows so I just use a darker shade just so it blends out pretty seamlessly we're gonna continue doing the same thing for the other brows everybody be like my brows are sister not twins please mine seems to be at least fraternal twins okay because uh-uh, we can't have them too far apart, okay? We gotta have them perfect. So I spend most of my time on my brows, literally. And if I'm doing eyeshadow, then eyeshadow as well. But those are the two things that take forever with Desiree. And as you can see, that concealer blends right on out. Now I'm just gonna add a little bit more of that concealer to my eyelids and use that as a primer base. So we're just going to add that and then we're going to blend it out with my beauty blender. This beauty blender has been saving my life for years, you guys. After we blend it out, I'm just going to be taking um, Laura Mercier and we're just going to set that really, really good because this is what helps the eyeshadows that I apply later blend out seamlessly. Make sure you press it into it so you won't have any creasing as well. Now we're going to be taking um, Oktoberfest from Coastal Scents. Those are the Coastal Scents Hot Pots. You guys don't know about that. I do. I think I do have a video. If I don't, I will make one. But they be 99 cents sometimes. Now I'm going to take that orange as well from Coastal Scents. Most of these colors are going to be from Coastal Scents. Some is going to be from the Morphe palette. Yeah. Then I'm going to take that same red from Coastal Scents as well. And we're going to just blend that into our crease because we want kind of a red look because we're having a red lip. So we're using red and pink. And the pink is kind of like my nails. It's going to be pink glitter. I had inspiration, you guys. Thank you, Tina, for doing my nails. Now we're just going to take more of that red and we're going to deepen it up to the color that we want it to be. And you just blending is key. Windshield wiper motions, circles are key to blending. I'm serious, you guys. Take your time and blend because it really, really helps. Now I'm going to take that Makeup Geek eyeshadow. I always forget this color, but I know Bitten was right next to it. But I'm going to take that color and we're going to put that on the outside B. I'm just going to blend that out into that red, into the crease color. We're making sure everything blends out. Then I'm going to take the um, Corrupt from Makeup Geek, which is that black shade. 
We're also going to put that in our outer V as well. Make sure we blend, blend, blend. Take your time, you guys, and blend. I know blending can be a hassle because it takes so long. But when you do, you will definitely see difference in your eyeshadow, the like application game. Okay. Then you will always want to go back with the other colors because you might lose a little bit of that color while blending a lot. So you just want to go back and forth with each brush, and I'm telling you, it will come out flawless. Now I'm just going to be taking a um, Max Mixing Medium. I'm not even going to cut my crease, but it's going to seem like a cut crease because I am just applying the glitter in my cut crease area. So I'm just going to apply that, mi that matte mixing medium and then apply the pink glitter. Now the pink glitter, you guys, y'all should know about my super $1 glitters. If you don't, I will eye card it right above. But these were only a dollar, you guys. So I'm just going to apply that glitter onto there. And it just brings in the look. Don't mind me. I'm watching This Is Us. You guys, oh my god, such a great show. Now we applied both glitters on both eyes. We're just going to be blending out the outer V. We're going to be cleaning up all that glitter fallout. And using it with the MAC medium, I literally don't have any fallout after I apply it. That MAC mixing medium is everything. So I'm going to take a wipe and clean that up. Now, I'm just going to be cleaning up my eyeshadow with a little concealer because I think I added a wing as well off camera. Now, I'm going to be taking my um, Tarte Maracuja Oil and apply that to my face. It has saved my life during the winter. Oh my gosh, because my skin has been so dry. It has saved my life. Now, we're going to take Iconic um, Highlighter Drops. I'm just gonna apply that to my highlighted places. As you see, I have a natural highlight already. Look at look at me glowing. And I haven't even applied it yet. So we're just gonna put that in my usual glow places. And we usually put this on top of that foundation. But I was like, let me try it, you know, under the foundation and see how it does. So I look like a disco ball. And then we're just gonna add my foundation. This is just a L'Oreal true match foundation in c9 i'm just gonna blend that all the way out with my morphe brush morphe is amazing they have that live glam subscription so you just pay 19.99 a month and you get free brushes every month sent to your home and that has literally changed my life my kit oh especially my kit my kit is full of morphe brushes and i'm so excited and they have been working out really, really good. And I'm blending out that foundation with a beauty blender just to take all the excess out. And that glow under there. Yes, ma'am. Blend that out. And now it's concealer time, okay? And I'm going to be using the same concealer, the Infallible Pro Glow from L'Oreal. And it's a little thin, like I said before, but if you do the trick, you know, Auntie Jackie told me, well, she mother to me, so Mother Jackie told me is to let it sit there and dry and you'll get the most payout of color. So we're just going to apply that under our eyes, down our bridge of our nose, on our forehead, and our chin. So I'm just going to let that sit on there and dry. And then we're going to get our beauty blender and blend it on out. Yeah, we're just going to blend out all the places we put that concealer. And it's coming out pretty good, you guys. And then we're going to be setting it with a mixture of the Sasha Buttercup banana powder and then the Topaz powder from Benai. So I mix those two because sometimes that banana powder can be too yellow and then that Topaz color can be just too orange. So mix them both together and you have the perfect shade for some people. And I have this today. I am so into this show, y'all. Look at me. 
I can never do a makeup tutorial without looking at a show. And I'll be trying to just so I can get it over with it fast and I won't be looking away. But it just does not happen. I need some time of entertainment. Now I'm taking my big fluffy brush that I got from Morphe as well. And I'm going to be using my Black Up Cosmetics Loose Powder. And it's in the darkest shade. And then we're going to apply this blush. And this is a berry blush from La Flamme. Yes, I love La Femme blushes. Blushes. And then we're going to be contouring with a dark brown eyeshadow, actually. Since I don't have a dark contour color, I'm doing it with the eyeshadow. Then we're going to take Artist Couture Conceited. And that's going to be our top highlighter. Oof. Look at that, y'all. Like, I gag every time I put on this. Ooh. Ooh. Literally, look at that. Yes. Yes, mama. How do you go tell your mama your sister your cousin? I love it. Happy Valentine's Day, you guys. This is a complete look. I literally just popped on some glasses. Some. I just popped on some lashes and popped on a red lip and voila you have the perfect valentine's thank day thank you look. guys so much for watching this video i really hope you enjoyed watching it as much as i enjoyed making it for you guys and happy valentine's day okay i hope you got all the flowers the chocolates the cards something else you know thing but anyway I hope you got all that you wanted with your special loved one, your significant other, your hubby, your boo, your bae, some people they side boos, you know, you know what I'm saying? I hope you got what you wanted and achieved it with this look. If you wore this look, girl, you got everything you wanted because um, nobody can deny this red lip and pink glitter. Like, you cannot deny that. How? when where <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe press that sub subscribe button you guys like it won't hurt it won't bite and don't forget to comment down below on uh, what you want to see next from me and i'll definitely keep it in mind and try to do more consistent videos so thank you guys again don't forget to find your rare beauty I'm fantasy. I've been down so long, you look back up to me. They looked up to me. I got fake people showing fake love to me. Straight up to my face. Straight up to my face. I've been out so long, it look like up to me They look up to me I got fake people showing fake love to me Straight up to my face Straight up to my face, yeah That's my girl, that's my chick, that's my dream, that's all mine Cruising slow, ocean drive, made a wave, watch them ride Ain't no love, ain't no time, it's running out I run my town, I never like guns, I still don't now But I shoot for the stars, got the stars all out J-U-S, that's my name, Long Island, that's where I came Back in the day, there were slaves who just wanna be free Now they said we all free, but we want them chains Man, do it make sense? I don't think life do Tell me what's the right move, word Hardly sleeping, lying better wait all these chances i just gotta take 